Good evening guys and welcome back to another video here in Swat, Pakistan. We're in northern Pakistan and I'm here with the big man. Good evening! <laughs> and today we're going to go on a little market hunt and... Uh, yeah, sure. Cheers bro. A little market hunt and explore some of the town uh, slash city that we're in. So we're in uh, Swat which is known as the Switzerland of Pakistan and you can see why. Crazy views with like a nice little sunset happening right now. And okay, so we just hopped out of the driver. We have a driver at the moment. We also have the man Akram, who's our tour guide for the next few days. And we're gonna be exploring Hunza and the north with him. I'm glad we do have a tour guide because we would not know exactly what we're doing. So we're just cruising on and up here. Looks like we're in kind of like the uh, auto repair area of town. Seems to be the areas of the. Seems to be uh, a bit like Jordan, where there's uh, specific areas for specific industries, and this one is the auto repair. And funnily enough, Akram was just saying that this place is famous for selling rims. You can get them very cheap here, and so that explains why there are so many different places selling them. Salam. Oh, we got some samosas. I am hungry, but probably not street food. There we go, guys. We got some. I'm not sure if that would pass for safety regulations. We got some uh, some markets over here. It's looking quite cool with the like blue hour look with the mountains in the background, and like the buildings go all the way up there. Had to get an energy drink because me and Mac have been uh, having some late nights editing vlogs so that we can have so that we make sure that we can upload so that we make sure we can upload during uh the period when we're in hunza we might not have wi-fi so we uh we're pretty tired but this will give us the energy we need okay so we're coming over here this is apparently whoa so this is the uh process of making bulk food he's got some egg he's got some burgers which I'm guessing, yeah, that'll be beef. And he cooks it all in this huge, like, massive frying pan. So much oil. Assalamu alaikum. It's crazy. So much oil. Yeah. Pasta turned in there. Ah, so this so is the patty. Built in the meat, the eggs, and the tomato all in there. He's just got a huge amount of meat here. And then tomato is uh, wow, that's crazy. And then he adds these spices and the pepper. Wow. We got some fish here. Assalamu alaikum. Keseho. Good, good. Dige. Here we have some dry fruits. Whoa, it looks very pretty. We've got all the different spices here. Assalamu alaikum. Very nice shop. And we've got all the different types of nuts here. I wish I could tell you which type of nuts these are, but they look really cool, really pretty. Got some coconuts up there, and all these spices. Say again? Naveed. Naveed? Yeah. Nice to meet you, I'm Harry. And you're from, uh, you're from Hunza, uh, you from Swat? Yeah, I'm from Swat. Nice. It's a, it's a cool place, it's uh, with the mountains. Yes. The yeah, really cool. It's, uh, we, we just arrived today, so we're still. No, uh, we arrived in SWAT today. We've been in Pakistan, yeah. Pakistan for three weeks. Uh, no, we came to Karachi, okay. then Lahore, then Islamabad, and now here. Okay. So, yeah, we've done all. Oh. Nice to meet you, my friend. Thank you. Just cooking some uh, sweet corn. So, I guess that's where all the locals eat. Although, sweet corn's not, not a very big meal. So these are pomegranate, which uh, these are pomegranate. This is the dream for people that are OCD. Yeah. <laughs> Everything is perfectly aligned. They seem to love pomegranate here for some reason. Wherever you go, they've got pomegranate juice. And I wouldn't say I'm a massive fan. I like having the pomegranate actual fruit, but I wouldn't, I'm not a big fan of the juice. This is sugar cane. Ah, okay. Do they grow that locally? 
Do they grow it locally? Yes. Okay, so he's... Oh, here we go. Here's the sugar cane. So he uses this tool to cut it up. Wow. Not sure if you guys can see that in the background, but got some like crazy sunset over the mountains. It looks so cool. Assalamu alaikum. Kese ho? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We've walked up to like this uh, area where they sell wedding decorations and they've got, it's got almost like Hawaiian flowers and then these like really colorful so these are decorations this is for the bride for the bride oh wow quite a few different options really cool very colorful I guess obviously these types of weddings are very colorful they try and, and I've noticed this in like Pakistani culture they do try and make everything colorful like the buses are all colorful and it's but, it kind of feels like Thailand, the way they've got so many street stalls. We've got some kebab here. Some shawarma. That does look good to be fair. But uh, I don't know if my stomach would agree with that. Oh, so this is the intersection here. And this reminds me of Karachi. The way there's just no rules. It's just every man for themselves. They have got a traffic warning. They have got a traffic warning. Yeah, Assalamu alaikum. Kaise ho? Shukran Allah ka ji. Bada hai isme bada. Oh that's small. Bada hai. Bada dikha. Try it we'll show you the big one. Yeah this is quite small. Chota hai chota. Small small. Big. Big. This is big. This is almost too big. Oh, the king! What do you guys think? Good? Nice. Yeah? Yes. Shall I get it? Yeah, I think I should get it, guys. Thank you. Uh, how much, my friend? I want the Johnny price. The local price. You want to or not? Uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna request, I'm gonna do the purchasing process with the gloves separately. Okay, okay. Start final with that. Some cooker, okay. I'm on Zasio, right? I'm on Zasio. Chess, Six hundred. Six hundred. Best price? Yes. Should I do some haggling? That is. You do five hundred? Five hundred. Mine's okay, right? Mine's okay? Okay. Yeah? Okay guys, 500 for this, not too bad. We've gone down 100. Happy with this guys. I'm gonna look like more of a local now. And uh, it might keep me warm in this cold weather. What do you think? Do I, do I fit in now? Uh, so I paid 500 for this bad boy, which is a pretty good price, $2.80. So I think, uh, yeah, I think I paid a fair price for this. Maybe, maybe a tiny bit more, but uh, I got him down 100. So I'm happy with that, happy purchase, happy man. And if you think I was going to buy it and not wear it, you were completely wrong. And now, if I wasn't getting stared, if I wasn't being stared at before, I'm definitely getting stared at now. But you just got to take it in your stride, guys. Okay. We got good sweets in here, yeah. Ooh, you're talking my language. Look what we got, guys. We got everything. We got cake, sweets. These like thin sweets. Assalamu alaikum. Got some cookies, some pastries, more cakes, more biscuits. Oh, don't look over here, Matt. Oh, no way. We got chocolate cakes on deck, baby. Mm -mm, good. Kese ho? Aap ka naam kya hai? Uma? Nice to meet you. It's a good name. That looks very interesting. No, it's moldy. But. Hmm. Which one? Which one's best? Which one would you? Special one, say. Yes, one. Yes, This this part is like a special one. Okay. Yeah. Uh, one of these, and and one of these. 
One, one, and one. So we've got some taste? special oh, biscuits here. Coconut? Coconut mixed chocolate. Uh, yep. How much? Rupee? 30, 30. Oh, 30. That's super cheap. Uh, so I've gone for something different. I've been having a lot of cake recently, so I decided to ask what they what they recommended. It's filming yet? Yeah. And they recommended these special ones. So I just picked. This looks a bit like a cookie. Whoa! That's a G double O D response. Kind of like a shortbread. Oh, very nice. Like a biscuit. This looks like bread, but it's not bread. Some nuts in it Whoa. or something? Mm. Mm. That's so good. It's like a um, crunchy shortbread with nuts in. And then the final one, this one. Looks like some sort of coconut gig. Oh yeah. Again, another type of shortbread slash biscuit with coconut in. Mm, I guess that I'd one say, right. Yeah, yeah, that was a good guess. I'd say this is probably my favorite, just because it's very simple. It's almost like a biscuit. Mm. Really good. You can tell they've got lots of sugar in there, but it's really nice. That's like an English biscuit. Mm. You have one of those with a cup of joe and you've uh, never been better. And how's yours? You know, living the dream, bro. The chocolate dream. You know me. Every chocolate cake's one kilo closer to uh, hitting the gym. Assalamu alaikum. Kesehu? Good, good, good. Al Hafiz. Shukriya. Oh, that was a perfect little treat. Perfect. That really hit the spot. I haven't eaten much today. I just had an omelet, so. Yeah, that was really good. Now, whoa, that was close call, as per usual. And now we're back at the car. So we're gonna head and get some food, I think. Okay guys, we've just arrived at this really nice restaurant um, to get some food, maybe some cheese paratha. And you can see they've got like these really cool buildings here. And then these like very small buildings where you can eat. It's really cool. They're like little tin huts where you can eat. We are using this kind of uh, arts oh, nice. for privacy. Oh, that's and nice. In winter, it's also looks keeps cool. you warmer. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. The second floor. And it's looking rather nice. Assalamu alaikum. And they got the fire heater, they got some really cool lighting. Yeah, this is a bit of me. Okay guys, so this is where we come, G Kerbin, and what have we got to eat? We've got loads, we've got fish, chicken, biryani, this is all very traditional, daisy food, looks really good. And uh, I'll have the same, so chicken fried rice, prata and uh, tea. Go chicken fried rice. Yeah. <laughs> tea? Go chai Green tea? No, no, normal chai. Normal chicken, chai. Green tea, do fried rice. Yes, do fried Very simple men, aren't we, Mac? We order the same. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> okay, here we go, here we go. Chicken Thank you. And a little We've got a nice big dish of chicken fried rice. It's my go-to meal. We've got the chicken is very finely cut in there. We've got some veg, maybe some onions, some tomato. Looks really good. I'm gonna scoop it up. Oh yeah, really nice different to a chicken biryani in that the, the chicken pieces are very finely cut and it's uh, the, the rice is really cooked very well so that's a really nice meal and then this uh, paratha bread paratha even with 
I think it's got like se sesame seeds on it. Oh, I heard that accent. Barata. Barata. Uh huh. It's coming along. <laughs> Donduri? Donduri, bro. Donduri. Yes. Mm. It's not as good as the, the oily one, but it's still very nice and it mixes with the rice very well. And then finally the chai tea, but I'm actually going to let that cool down a little bit. Sorry, the green tea even looks very good. Oh yeah, as you guys can tell, I did enjoy this meal. How was it for you, bro? I'm still working over here. <laughs> We're about halfway through. Yeah. Good though? Oh, very good. Very yeah. Delicious, yeah. I was uh, quite impressed with it. But I tell you, the Pakistan portions of food are very large. There's few meals that I've been able to finish while I'm in Pakistan, so. If I did, let me tell you this, I'd be sitting up here like this. <laughs> Um, so I'm not gonna finish that prata bread, but prata bread even. But yeah. Okay, guys. So the final bill came to 830 for two big meals and four chais. So I'd say that was very good value for money, about four and a half dollars. Very happy with that. Got the locals' price, which is nice. Shukriya, al hafiz. Just had a nice meal, and now we are heading back up to the room. The restaurant was just five minutes away from the uh, hotel so it's a nice God little trip back and we're ready to rest because we've had a very long day as per and uh, been working very hard. <laughs>